Mexico is one of the most highly anticipated events on the F1 calendar, with its high altitude capital embracing the race with passion every year. But it's by no means a new event, with a Mexican round on the F1 World Championship schedule since 1963. Mexicans also have a long glittering history of competing at the pinnacle of motorsport, with seven F1 drivers, six of whom have started a race for 20th overall in the list of nations. The trailblazer was Ricardo Rodriguez, who had 13 starts with Ferrari in 1961 and 1962, but was tragically killed later that year on home soil in a non-championship race at the circuit the Autodromo Hermanos Rodriguez that was later named after him and older brother Pedro, who raced in F1 for a number of constructors, including Lotus, Ferrari, Cooper and BRM across 54 starts between 1963 and 1971. The older Rodriguez brother netted two wins and one fastest lap. During the same era, Mexico also fielded Moises Solana, but he secured just eight starts from 1963 to 1968 in the USA and Mexico rounds, with his best result 10th at the 1964 race for Lotus on home soil. Hector Rabac was another F1 journeyman who had 41 starts between 1977 and 1981 with his best result 4th. More recently, Esteban Gutierrez had 59 starts in F1, but also never made the podium. Across stints for Sauber and Haas, Gutierrez never looked like a contender and is now brand and business ambassador at Mercedes. A world away from Red Bull's top tier wingman, Sergio Perez, the most successful Mexican Grand Prix driver of all time. Checo raced for a number of teams before he joined Red Bull, including Sauber, McLaren, and Force India Racing Point. He has more F1 starts than all the other Mexican racers combined. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.